Hey folks, what's up? Welcome back to another Poem Masters video, and we have the Diantha 5 out of 5 nodes out, and thankfully, I did already have her at 5 out of 5, um, just, I don't remember how her pulls went, uh, on, on like, her, her initial banner, it was like, to be fair to me, it was like, almost two years ago, <laughs> but I'm pretty sure I got a few off dailies to max her out, right? Um, not recently, but you know, in the past, but anyways, Let's, uh, let's try it out. Let's try it out. So, um, her 4 out of 5 slash 5 out of 5 notes slash also 2 out of 5 notes Loki, which are actually kind of good. Um, like, on a roll over here to help, uh, Moonblast, uh, debuff the opponent's special attack is, like, Loki, not bad. Uh, considering, you know, you kind of need that for devastation. And then, because, you know, Satisfied Snicker, which you do get at 4 out of 5, is not going to get you that minus 6 in, like, 3 turns, obviously. So that's kind of decent. And then also speedy entry. Loki, pretty good too. Like, again, people talk about the 4 out of 5, 5 out of 5 notes, but also remember there's like 2 out of 5 notes, which are pretty good, right? In this case. And I just completely deleted my grid. It's okay. I remember this one, all right? Um, memory is still worth uh, a bit, uh, slightly. So, anyways, uh, let's try it out. So, let's first go with this um, grid that I, I feel like most people are more, uh, I guess, hyped about, which is the Satisfied Snicker, which could help her, uh, obviously, debuff the opponent's special attack more efficiently by herself. You could have always, you know, <laughs> used other supports to help, but like Wally. Uh, although, to be fair, uh, with Wally, like, Wally's B move is great and all, but like, the one slightly annoying thing is it, you do have to have a Mega. Like, you have to have someone Mega, which means someone has to sync already, so you can't get it off for Diantha in the first sync, right? So that's why, like, if you are running, like, Wally and um, Diantha, you'll probably have to sync with Diantha, like, you know, on the second sync before, right? But now you could do it on the first sync. So uh, with this new upgraded grid, can she theoretically max out her Devastation Nuke on the first sync? Yeah, she could theoretically do it. Is it likely? Probably not. So let's, let's try that out, because... Here's what we're planning to do, okay? We're gonna have Chris. A uh, lot of RNG involved. Hopefully, Chris gets the MP refresh on her trainer move, right? And hope every single one of Diantha's Moon Blasts get on a roll. It's basically what we're trying to do here. So, uh, with enough RNG on your side, you could theoretically get dev full devastation. By your first sync, which we did not get. Imme we immediately did not get. And so, uh, yeah, let's, uh, let's, let's try this again after immediately failing. Um, I mean, look, let's not even just go for it. Let's not even go for it, man. It's, it's just unrealistic, incredibly unrealistic, um, to be fair, right? So, that's, it's, it's not gonna happen, man. There we go, we got one. Oh, we got the MP refresh we needed. Look at that. Oh, can we actually do it? Can we get max devastation on first sync here? Uh-huh. We got the MP refresh from Suicune as well. Rip. Never mind. Rip. Rip the dream. It's not happening. Okay. Well, we were close. <laughs> but again, you probably don't want to do it anyways, just because, like, with Wally, if you do, if you do have the right stuff on Wally, right? Like, you could sync a turn earlier. Like, I'd rather, I'd rather sync a turn earlier than go for, like, a max devastation nuke, which is, you know, which is nice, but it's not like, yeah, it's not that big of a deal. <laughs> right, so. Anyways. Oh, got another NPR. Unfortunately, our rain's going away. Which is not that big of a deal. I mean, we could set it again. There's another MP. <laughs> but. I want you to get minus four from herself in one sync cycle. Okay, it's better than like an average of maybe minus one before. <laughs> So yeah, like this, the 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 self uh, special attack debuffing thing, it's neat. But again, I don't feel like it's that big of a deal, right? I do think there's, and, and I'm not saying like she got nothing good on her grid. Right? There's definitely good stuff on her grid. Um, de definitely good stuff on her grid. Like this, uh, the recharging strike, at least for the gauges back, is definitely neat. Since uh, you know, she's not that great of a gauge unit for one. So, I mean, I'll take that, right? That's, uh, that's, that's, that's an alright thing, uh, for one. And also, uh, the propulsion stuff, which is also really, really good. That's on, I think, the top left. Well, I wouldn't say really, really good, because 
just because my Wally is built that it doesn't really like matter. Just because my uh, you know, Wally has enough sync move countdown um, himself right over here. So like in this scenario, it doesn't really matter. Oh, are we gonna get taken out? Is this is this sync physical? It might be physical, honestly. <laughs> uh, it is physical, but we're alive. I mean, Diantha is. Uh, let's see. Was it physical? I don't even know, man. Whatever. <laughs> well, here's a max devastation, or at least on the mid. Uh, off type, do keep in mind, but, uh, yeah, uh, I mean, it's alright. <laughs> it's alright. It's alright. Uh, again, I, I personally would not recommend doing that, but there are some other cool things that you could definitely do. I feel like something more fun could be, like, a build, uh, like this. I'm, so oh, I'm sorry, the thing. Can I, can I make the browser small so it fits in there? No, it doesn't. It just looks weird now. All right, well, uh, whatever. I'll, I'll show you guys the thing uh, over here. So basically, uh, you pick up at the top here. Uh, obviously, she still has Devastation if you want. I mean, I personally don't care too much about her nuke, but, I mean, sure. Uh, you can still pick up Satisfied Snicker as well. And uh, on top of that, you could pick up the Propulsion 9. Which is, I believe, a uh, five and five node, right at the bottom, or, or top, top, top right, uh, or top left. I, oh my god, <laughs> top right as I scroll through the bottom left, and then I say, uh, oh, <laughs> whatever. Um, it's, it's, it's top left, okay, over there, uh, five and five node, um, and then you could like pick up head start, so that would make it so that, like, by herself, you could shred a entire. Um, turn or or entire well yeah entire turn of sync move countdown, which is kind of good, which is kind of good, right? Um, which in this specific comp it doesn't matter that much because like my Wally is built <laughs> so that he could shred an entire turn down by himself with like head start one in his grid, head start one in his passive, and also give him head start one lucky skill. <laughs> so it doesn't matter in that sense. It's not like. Oh, we're gonna sink in after one turn because you'd have to like use two propulsions. Um, but still, right? But what if we added one more head start unit that is a support that you could sink with, right? Since probably not gonna get like max stats up that quick, right? Well, you know, look what happens now, <laughs> okay? <laughs> so we gridded a Brendan with head start and adrenaline. Not that it's necessary, but you know, still, right? Okay, watch closely, folks, all right? Look what is going to happen here. All right, so same with countdown at nine, right? Nine more turns. Oh, 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 what's going? Oh, oh, four, <gasps> four, another one. Oh, three, a two. Oh, uh, uh, he uses one move there. He's down to one. He uses another one. <gasps> one turn sink. <laughs> so, like, yeah, yeah. Like, the, the, the very, very low chance of getting your full Devastation in, in the first sync. It's attractive, it's fun, it looks cool, but like, mm, I don't know, man. I feel like this one's a bit more fun. I feel like this one might be a bit more fun, folks. <laughs> one turn sync uh, to, you know, uh, after resetting 15 times to get the uh, full Devastation nuke. In and uh, out in 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 the first sync, or immediately get your first sync, like almost instantly, and get and so you can get your fully set up with no pressure at all, right? No RNG or whatever, um, easily on your second sync. Also, I probably could have used another um time to shine there as well. So, yeah, I don't know, man. <laughs> I like the other one. I like the other one. Ouch, that kind of hurt, but you know, sorry. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, like career grid. Um, obviously this this is the this is not the grid for. I'm gonna do the most damage as I can on like this one hit or whatever, right? That's that's not that, but it's a better one. It, I like it better. Okay, if again, if you do have the, you know, other. <laughs> Helpers, right, to help with the extra sync move countdown. Damn. Okay. <laughs> oh, really? I'm. You know what? 
I'm not I'm not gonna even give 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 that unit the respect to finish it off. So uh, overall, is is the grid like you know great and fixes all of Diantha's problems? No, not really. It doesn't fix all her problems, uh, but it does create some new solutions or new pathways for her that are uh, honestly really fun. So um, if you do have five out of five Diantha. Uh, slash 4 out of 5. Well, I, I, well the single countdown, I think, is 5 out of 5, right? Uh, well, congratulations. Uh, but if you don't have it, uh, if you don't have her more than 3 out of 5 or whatever, then uh, don't worry too much about it. Like, honestly, the 2 out of 5 upgrades are definitely really, really nice, even if you don't have the uh, 5 out of 5, um, right? Like, you're missing this, this, these two. Also, slightly funny, this initial synchro healing. I'm not sure if you guys could read it. I'll, I'll read it for you. So, um, initial synchro healing, 1, uh, is one of her five out of five notes, right? Cost ten energy, <laughs> and so is all the ally of all all sync pairs by ten percent of their maximum HP. <laughs> and it's only the first time the sync is used in each pal, so um, that's that's kind of a weird node to have that like five out of five, um, meaning not not that great. Uh, but yeah, like still, if if you don't have if you just have her like three out of five, you still get some nice stuff, right? Like on a roll to help with your moon blast slash devastation. It's obviously not satisfied snicker nine, which is guaranteed, but you do have a extra bit of chance there. And then also you have speedy entry, which is nice to help her gauge issues as well, right? You could pick that up with fleet feet and she had some really, really nice speed, right? Uh, but if you do have her five out of five, um, the, the, the funny sync move, and you also have uh, a Wally, a sync to Wally setup like mine and, and you know, another support. Um, preferably a mega sport that has like head start or like at least minus one sync move countdown. Uh, you could do some really, really funny <laughs> stuff here as well. So, all in all, um, not a groundbreaking grid um, for most people, right? But uh, it's it's a it's got some cool, funny stuff in there. It's got some cool stuff in there, all right? So, it's, it's, it's not completely worthless, it's not like terrible, but uh, it's, it's yeah, it's, it's also not something that you'd be totally missing out on if you don't have so <laughs> anyways that's me in this one i guess hope you all gentlemen guys think in the comments below like enjoy the videos for our channel for some more bomb content then i'll see you guys in the next one then